All right, in this video, I'd like to talk about an alternative to the traditional fade in and fade out that you can use when you're editing or mixing. What a lot of people will do is come up here to effect and they'll choose fade in or fade out. And that works just fine. I think an alternative though, that can make the track sound a little bit more like a crescendo, a gradual getting louder or getting softer, is to use what's called adjustable fade. And I like this because it really, uh, it really changes uh, the, the dynamic contrast of the highlighted region. So the one that I have used is what's called S curve up. And this is for the beginning. And when you click on it, you'll notice that it's a little bit more of a dramatic and what I would also say is a little smoother uh, contrast of the dynamics. If I come here to the very end of the track, and again I'm just being somewhat random in where I select, again come down to effect, choose adjustable fade, and in this case I'm going to choose F S curve down. I have what I feel is a little bit of a smoother overall track. This is somewhat arbitrary. You can experiment with these and use the fade in and the fade out uh, as you see fit. But if you like a little bit more of a dramatic approach to your editing, this is a tool that I think you'll find useful. Again, it's right up here in the effect menu and you just come down to adjustable fade. 